S1 January 2011 question 6 continuous random variables sum of all probabilities is 1 so if we integrate from 0 to 1 with respect to x then we should get 1 so k okay, x to the n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 between 0 and 1 must be 1 substituting in get 1 over n plus 1 take away 0 equals 1 so k equals n plus 1 as asked for in the question then asked to find an expression for e of x I'm going to leave the k in and substitute at the end so e of x is the integral from 0 to 1 of k times x times x to the power n so we're integrating x to the power n plus 1. If we add 1 to the power, we get n plus 2 and divide by the new power n plus 2 between 0 and 1. So this is k times 1 over n plus 2. And k is n plus 1. So it's n plus 1 over n plus 2. Variance of x will be the expectation of x squared minus the expectation of x all squared. Expectation of x squared will be the integral of x squared times x to the power n. So that's the integral of x to the power n plus 2. Add 1 to the power and divide by the new power between 0 and 1 and remembering our k which gives us k times 1 over n plus 3 so that's n plus 1 over n plus 3 finally to work out the variance take the expectation of x squared and subtract the expectation of x all squared I'm not going to simplify this fraction, we'll leave this in this form and you can see that they accepted that on the mark scheme.